And the nice thing up there is the reason they get 12 and 14 pound fish in Quincy, they don't keep any fish. And that fish come in, cook pictures, back in the water. So we're not going to get a 15 pounder if we eat all the 11s and 10s and 9s. And so I was really surprised at that. And they're salmon the same way. They'll catch a salmon. Nick got a steelhead that was big. And uh, we didn't weigh it or anything. We took pictures of it back in the water. So that's how you get big fish, is by letting them tens go, keeping the twos and threes and fours. Mm -hmm. And if you want to go out there and run a, a two, three ounce bottom bouncer with a, with a uh, tube jig, and you want to get some monster smallmouth, find them humps out there. There is smallmouth out there sitting on the bottom that no one's ever put a lure by. And when they, yeah, when they come up there and you see a five-pound smallie hauling a three-ounce bottom bouncer out of, the, out of the water, it's like, wow. <coughs> so I, I'd love to get out there with a, somebody that knows how to fish bass, which I don't. I went and fished with Al Linear this year and had fun. But get out there in that deep water with real good boat control and, mm -hmm. and tube jig like they do in Lake Erie. Sure. I think there's a smallmouth fishery that would put us on the map. Just doing that. The state record's going to come from up in here. So I wouldn't be surprised. I weighed in a lot of seven, seven and a half.